Top 16 Best Things to Do in Kalbayog City The city of Kalbayog is a first-class city in Samar region, Visayas, Philippines. It's situated in Samar's seaside district, with around 60 miles from the north to 180 miles in the south. It's the main city in Samar and the 19th in the nation. There are numerous activities in Kalbayog City being a spot radiating with various common attractions, for example, plunging spots, rich woodlands, and streams. Thus, the city is getting increasingly more notable among nearby and unfamiliar vacationers. Here are probably the best things you can do when you're in Kalbayog City. Kalbayog Zipline and Malajog Edge Nature Park. The rush looking for exercises of the nature park and zipline guarantee guests can get a terrific perspective on the untamed ocean. It just pauses for a moment to ride the zipline. There are different exercises that individuals can participate in like swimming, going on a banana boat ride, and stream ski ride in low OCC shore and waterway journey at Bolong to Waterway. Bang on Bugtong Falls. Bang on Falls can be reached by taking a jeepney or van ride to Barangay Tinaplakan. The assessed stature of Bang on Falls is 60 meters. You wouldn't see where the water of Bang on Falls comes from since it extends far. It has tricky parts because of greenery and a lake at the top where individuals can appreciate swimming in light of the fact that the water is sufficiently profound. Sarakiki Hadong Celebration. Hyperactive developments describe the exhibitions of Sarakiki celebration, and it should express appreciation to their divine beings. It suggests love for their divine beings, where they likewise offer penances to keep risk under control. In prior occasions, local people would utilize highly contrasting chicken quills as offering to adore the spirits. The celebration happens each September 1st to 8th. Busai and Tarangban Falls. These two falls can fulfill your desires for a decent swimming and chilling spot. The extra charge for Busai Falls is free while you need a guide going to Tarangban Falls. The two falls should be reached through traveling, and both are exceptional in their own particular manner and loaded up with solid trees and brilliant stone developments. The two cascades can be delighted in while having a cookout, and you can swim in the event that you need to. City Woods and Marble Park. This isn't generally a recreation center where you can see seats or sculptures but instead a spot where there are a marble rock arrangement and numerous trees. You can wander the territory or need to take pictures, and you can swim at the Malajog waterway. The Immaculate Backwoods gives you access Kalbayog's valuable environmental factors. The Sovereign of the Most Sacred Rosary Holy Place. The Sacred Hallowed Place was a task of Mr. Leonardo Hermo Oban Jr. or on the other hand Jr. for short, a barangay chief of Barangay Malajog. The property utilized for making the holy place has a place with an expired couple, Catalino Polito Oban and Dionysia Abayan Oban, who were blood family members of Jr. The altar turned into a spot where numerous individuals would simply ask and have calm snapshots of examination, yet today, even vacationers do likewise. Caracol Celebration Local people of Barangay Matabato commend this lesser-known celebration. The shore where the picture of Nuestra Señora de Porta Vega, Soleda, is found is additionally the spot where the celebration happens. Local people make kubol or cabins line the sandy piece of the ocean, and from the house of prayer, the picture will be taken out and will pass the kubols until it arrives at the primary kubol where a service will happen. This celebration happens each second Sunday of November. Isla Pagan. Pagan Islet, or Turtle Island to local people, is an islet which takes after the state of a turtle. It's around 1 hectare, and an excursion there can offer some zapping undertakings like remote ocean jumping where you can see marine life like ocean corals, uncommon rocks, shells, and some ocean animals. In case you're not very enthusiastic about remote ocean jumping, you can simply take photos of the wonderful stone arrangements encompassing the islet. Keepsake Shopping one of the greatest pay wellsprings of Kalbayog City is its fish industry. They make great dried and smoked fish. Take some restored fish home with you however ensure you pack them firmly on the grounds that they smell. Simply remember to let it inhale once you return home so it won't decay. Butterfly Asylum at Antonio's Nursery. The Butterfly Asylum at San Antonio's isn't as large as different attractions, yet it merits the visit on the off chance that you simply need to go through an hour and take a gander at their man-made scaled-down falls, Butterfly Garden, and Koi Lake. The children will cherish this exceptional shelter since they can see the creatures very close. 
Buenogoa Cavern. Entering the cavern is no issue on the grounds that the passage is huge. However what will make your spelunking excursion to Guinagone Cavern distinctive is that you'll stroll through the water where the roof can go high on certain parts shockingly low on the others. It's a supernatural experience, particularly when you arrive at the cavern's dim breaks, where the solitary things you'll see are lit lights for direction. Attempt this experience in case you're sufficiently valiant. Mapaso Natural Aquifer Feel invigorated after a characteristic and boiling water treatment at Mapaso Underground Aquifer. Its name, Mapaso, signifies hot in Filipino in light of the fact that the water there arrives at extraordinary temperature. In the event that you like some muscle unwinding for your body during the colder months, at that point head on to Mapaso Natural Aquifer, where you can truly appreciate with your family and have your nerves slacken up a bit. Nijaga Park This interesting park is set close to the Kalbayog waterway, so it's anything but difficult to unwind and go through an early evening time taking a gander at the skyline. You can discover a wellspring in this unassuming park and vivid houses in the region. The recreation center additionally wakes up at evening time when the entire region is lit, and everybody can go for a stroll calmly. Samar Archaeological Exhibition Hall It's consistently something decent to visit at any rate one exhibition hall when you travel since it's a method to think about the historical backdrop of the spot you're visiting, and you will see intriguing stuff you won't see somewhere else. The Samar Archaeological Historical Center houses uncovered pieces like cups, saucers, cups, old family unit things, and old coins. These were the things utilized by local people once upon a time. Spanish Quarter Most Philippine territories have been impacted by the Spaniards in a manner on the grounds that the nation has been under their decision for a long time. A large number of the proof are structures that can be seen and unblemished up right up, till the present time. This remembers the houses for the zone of Calbayog City they call, Spanish Quarter. You'll see some saved Spanish houses right up, till today, and you can snap a photo of those houses obviously, ask pleasantly. You can likewise get some information about the historical backdrop of each house. Muro Puro Swimming Site Muro Puro is definitely not a mainstream plunging site yet, so you can in any case appreciate the vast waters and swim to your heart's enjoyment, yet it's simply an issue of time on the grounds that the marine site here is shocking. Set aside the effort to visit this spot while it's as yet immaculate. Do you have other prescribed fun and fascinating activities in Kalbayog City? If you don't mind don't hesitate to share by posting a remark underneath. Thank you for watching. Please don't forget to like, share and subscribe. Thanks so much.